Finishing up week 14, the Seattle Seahawks were able to get a 37-30 win over the Minnesota Vikings, and that makes it very interesting in the NFC, because now there's a likelihood that what you're going to see is that uh, it may take 11 wins just to be able to make the playoffs. Because you take a look at what's going on, you know, obviously San Francisco plays New Orleans uh, this week in week 14, and that winner is going to probably have one of the better chances to be a number one seed. But Seattle now has the lead over San Francisco, and they have a very good chance to maybe go to 12, 13, and more unlikely, but possible 14 wins. I mean, it's incredible to see the power structure of the NFC. For Minnesota, that loss pretty much puts them in a wild card mode unless Green Bay starts to falter. Green Bay sitting there at 9-3 and three with a chance to get with an easy schedule to run away with the division, but Minnesota's still there. They played tough in that game against Seattle, but the NFC is absolutely remarkable right now, and what's going to happen is that uh, you can see the winner of that San Francisco-New Orleans game is going to be in great shape, particularly if it's New Orleans. They've already won the division, and they can be the number one seed. The Professor's Notes is brought to you by Infinity of Tacoma at Fife.